fuck is that guy doing? That's not him. I think I'm a genius. I think I make the best art in the world. But you might go, I'm sorry, I think that's a heap of shite. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be controlled and I don't want to be nice and neat and tidy. I want to make a mess of your gallery. And I want to kind of fuck things up like that. I was brought up around huge things. Everything was massive. There's an excess or an, an, an extravagance involved. And I love that. My parents were wonderfully eccentric and encouraged me to be that exact thing by accident. My God, he really did it. He built something that was 100 miles long, made it of 5 million sea containers and God knows what else. I've been there, man. I've seen it, it's real. I'm a sucker for a nice painted hill with a stag on it or a boat in the water. I love those things. I don't want to make them. And I don't want it to be that when I go and visit a landscape show, I want to see other things. I'm expecting a lot of messages about how things actually are. You're not just talking about art then, you're talking about life and you're talking about people and that's the important stuff. Don't sort of be squeezed into some sort of convenient box for other people to wash you around and break out of the damn thing. It's not a safe thing to be an artist. Making an effort involves exactly that. You can't make a bit of an effort. You can't try it out. You've really got to put yourself out. And don't get above yourself. Let's not get carried away. Fuck that. That's exactly what I want to do. I want to get completely carried away. I would give that advice to anybody do anything. Shock me. Make me laugh. Make me think I have found the best work of art in this show. If you want the world to know who the hell you are, then you better put the fucking effort in. Say something for God's Set the fucking heather on fire. Do that. What's your best idea? The next one.